Welcome to Luigi's Play. Today we are talking about Semu Emulator for Android. Yeah, you can now play Wii U games on your Android phone or tablet. In this video, we will cover 1. What Semu Emulator is and what it can do. 2. How to download and install it on your Android device. Don't worry, it's super easy. And 3. The latest updates and change logs so that you know what is new and what is fixed. If you are a gamer or just curious about emulators, this video is for you. Before we dive in, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and hit the subscribe button now. It really helped me to create content like this, so please subscribe now. Now before I start, let me explain what Semu is. Semu is one of the first Wii U emulators that successfully boots games. It was released way back in 2015. And in 2022, it was made open source. About 2 years ago, Semu rolled out an experimental version, Semu 2.0, which is available. So, in August 2024, Simu Emulator Beta version of Android got released. Many people rushed and installed it and almost 90% of them faced poor performance, meaning the emulator has a long way to go. Yesterday, the version 7 beta of Simu was released and I'm very happy to share it with you guys. A lot of things got fixed, including a performance boost. In version 7, some games ran much better compared to the previous version and they also fixed some graphical bugs and issues. Now let me walk you through the installation process. I mean, take you through the process of downloading and setting up the emulator on your Android phone. Okay, so we are here for the installation of Semu emulator on Android. Now you have to download the latest version of the emulator, which is currently the Semu version 7, which is this one. So um, to download it, head over to, I mean, their GitHub page and get the latest version of the emulator so after getting the latest version now follow what i'm about to do first of all we need to install the emulator which is this one so click on it and then select install okay now we are done with the installation now open the emulator what's left next is press on this setting over here we can see something like add game path input settings graphics settings audio settings graphics pack blah 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 what you are going to you are going to do now is let's go back to z archiver this app and then open our internal storage so this is our internal storage now we need to create a folder i mean we need to create a folder and we will be using that folder for our wii u games or our same same games so to do that, press on this blue icon over here and then select new folder. Let's name this folder same. And then save it. Now let's open the folder. Inside the same folder, create additional folder or create another folder and name it ROMs. Okay, this ROM folder will be the folder that will contain our Wii U games. Let's get back to or uh, let's go back to our parent folder which is this site. Now, now watch here. You can see my game. I have the game over here. So what you have to do is move this game inside the ROM folder in the CU folder. To do that, just press on this icon, this this mark over here and then select your your games. Move them into semu and then inside the ROM folder. Okay. Um we are done with the first step. Now let's go back to the semu app. So what's left next is we are going to add the game path and to do that just press on this thing and then locate the folder that contains our semu 
ROMs or our Wii U games. Press on this plus icon over here and then head over to Semu and then ROMs because this ROMs folder contains our games. After selecting the ROMs folder, select this one which says use this folder and then press allow. Okay, so I think that's all. We are done adding the games folder. Here, my games appear here. That's it. Thank you for watching. If you really like this video, please subscribe to my channel.